children and families. I do hope you're all well and keeping safe at this time. And we all miss you um, from Jigsaw and we thought we'd like to send you some videos every so often. And I thought today I'd um, tell you how you could reenact Emma's stories she's sending round on her um, weekly links. And I know she's sending you a story of the lost sheep. So I thought we could have a go at having a little reenactment and then perhaps you can have a go and send them back to Emma and show her how you've done it. So for our sheep I thought we could use some socks. And then for our shepherd we can just have any cuddly toy we've got to hand or any doll or any book, anything we can find. So once upon a time there was a shepherd who had a hundred sheep. Now he loved all his sheep and he gave them all names and he knew all their names really well. And each night he would count his sheep. One, two, three, four, eighty-eight, ninety, ninety-five, ninety-six, ninety-seven, ninety-eight, ninety-nine. Oh, there's one missing. Who haven't I seen today? Oh, I don't think I've seen Blue Tuft. Oh dear, Blue Tuft, where have you gone? So the shepherd gets himself some packed lunch and off he goes to look for Blue Tuft. And he searches as high and low and he looks round things. And as he's walked a really long way, he finds Blue Tuft and he is so happy and overjoyed. Blue Tuft, there you are, I thought I'd lost you. And he gives Blue Tuft a big home, big cuddle and carries him home. And then he puts him back with the rest of the sheep. And then he calls all his friends round. And they have a big party, yay, and celebrate. Because Blue Tuff was lost and now he's found. And this is just a really good story in the Bible that tells, shows us um, about God's love for us. Because God is the shepherd and, and we are sometimes in the Bible called his sheep. And he knows each one of us by name. And he really loves us and cares for us. And he will travel across the whole world to find us until we become his friends. And it's just good to remember at this time that if we ever feel lonely or if, or um, sad, we can um, just call out to God or pray to God and ask him to come and help and be our friend and just guide us. So this is just a good thing to remember. And I hope, children, that you all have a good week and that you'll all have a go at uh, retelling Emma's stories and sending her back the, um, your videos so that we can see how you're getting on. And I hope you have a good week and take care. Till next time. Bye.